oh, we just yeah, we just practice as, if, uh, as as we did last week. I mean, it's one of those things you just have to work with with the referees. I mean, it's a new law, understanding interpretations and whatnot. But obviously, it's an area we need to make sure we get right. Um, so we limit penalties and limit you know scoring opportunities for them, or just you know penalties to get them out of their sort of you know, their D zone. So I think it's important. But yeah, we've done we've done the work, and hopefully we can um, you know work well with the referee on Saturday. Uh, yeah, it's obviously. You know, I, I don't like losing. No one likes losing, um, and you know we we got to do everything we can to turn that around. And um, uh, you know, I, I obviously didn't play any part of, of last year's Test series due to injury, and uh, you know it's even up probably harder sitting watching uh, a team struggle. So we need to do everything we can, and we have been this week to to turn that around. Um, oh look, I think you know you got to look at New Zealand rugby. There's they've got a lot of depth and it's one of the strengths of New Zealand rugby is that they've got depth. You just have to look at the World Cup as a perfect example of, you know, you were down, I think, the fourth or fifth, five, eight, you won the World Cup. So it's, uh, uh, you know, a guy, as Will said, a guy on a debut in a playmaking position, you always got to make sure that you, I guess you test out what's going on, but he wouldn't be there if he, if, if he wasn't good enough. And you know, there's so many good players through New Zealand, and there's a number of guys that could step into that position. And I feel that he's he's been picked there because he's good enough. And I'm, and I'm sure the, their coaching staff wouldn't have put him there if they didn't have the belief in him. Not really. I mean, I, I don't I don't feel that pressure. I mean, I I don't see myself as being any more important or integral to to the side than any other player. I mean, everyone in their own right is selected in the team to do a job, and it's about doing that job to the best of their ability so that we can function well as a team. We've got threats right across the park. It's just about doing, you know, each person doing their job as well as they can. I think we had a we had a good night out last weekend, but that was last weekend. And, you know, we need to keep working. It was something we'd worked a lot on in the two weeks. Um, leading into that first test was, was working on our line out and working on, um, you know, our, the way we, we go about, we spend a lot of time, you know, analysing and, and doing stuff that we felt would work. And now we need to make sure that we keep going on there. And we don't we don't rest on our laurels. And to that end, we're doing a lot more work this week again on on our line out. And you know, I think we've got some really good jumpers in the in the in the team. And being able to have four genuine, you know, jumpers is a is a big positive for us. Issue. No, well, you do, you need to test footy. You play all over the world. You know, you got to we play here, and then we're going. You know, we go home next week and then we go to Perth and then we go to South Africa. So you've got to win away from home. It doesn't matter where you play. You've just got to be able to prepare as well as possible to perform at that spot. And that's the way professional rugby is at the moment. You know, you need to win away from home. You need to win in different locations. And, um, you know, we've got to win tomorrow night.